everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a what's in my bag. Um, the bag I'm currently using is from New Look, it's last year's, it's getting a bit battered. I think it was about £20 but it's done me really good service. It's starting to go a little bit on the handles but it's been a really good bag. My first thing is my notebook. Now, anybody who watches Walking Dead, you'll know who this is. It's Daryl. Daryl's my favourite character. So inside, I've got my shopping lists, uh, my to-do lists, things I'm currently running out of, beauty supplies, toiletries, things like that. It's kept all inside Daryl. Daryl looks after it for me. The next is uh, my makeup bag. This one is from Victoria's Secrets. I think it was about eight pounds. It's done me really good service um, because sometimes if I, if I go out and I don't want to take a big bag, I'll just pop my bank card in. Yeah, it's smashing. So inside I've got um, a Charlotte Tilbury lip pencil in Pillow Talk. Love this shade. I think I've had about five of these now. Super shade. It goes with a lot of different lipsticks. Um, I've also got um, a Dior face powder just to you know touch up the shinies while, while you're out and about and that also came with its own little uh, kabuki brush so yeah just nice just to carry around in your handbag and the other thing I've got is a, a MAC lipstick in uh, Peach Blossom if you watch my August favourites, I uh, swatched a sample of that. So, yep, MAC. And the other thing I've got is um, a Dior lip gloss. Absolutely love Dior lip gloss. It is quite expensive. It's I think it's just over £20 for a lip gloss. Um, this one is Lip Maximizer. Now, it gives a nice pale pink shade and it sort of tingles a little bit on your lips, but... Obviously at my age, nothing's going to plump these lips up anymore, but uh, I absolutely love lip gloss. I'm a 70s girl, so it's all about lip gloss, so yeah. Uh, the next thing is uh, my iPhone. Love my iPhone. Um, my husband, John, he loves his Samsung phone. My eldest son, Thomas, he loves his Samsung phone. My youngest son David, he loves Apple. I love Apple. I've had quite a few of them now. Don't think I'd have a different sort of phone. Yeah, love it. Um, the next one is, oh, my reading glasses, because I'm afraid when you're my age, you need reading glasses. So yeah, I've always got some of them with me. Uh, the next thing is um, my purse. It's an Osprey purse. I got this one in TK Maxx. I've had it quite a few years now. It's done me really good service, but like the, the leather tags dropped off on the side and it's getting a bit battered and worn, so I am getting ready for a new one. So, But I think probably next time I'll go for something quite a bit smaller because like everybody now, you go in shops and you tend to use cards and people don't tend to carry cash around with them like they used to do. So I'll probably go for a smaller one. And then I've got, oh, coarse chewing gum. I've always got some of that in my bag. And, oh, reusable carrier bag. You've always got one of them in, your, in all your bags, haven't you? Uh, oh, pen. I do buy, I buy these in Clinton's, actually. Uh, I also pick up the pink one because they do a small donation uh, to breast cancer research. So I always pick one of those up. They're a gel pen and they write nicely, so yeah. Um, oh, the next one I've got is a L'Occitane hand cream. Um, it's always nice to have a bit of hand cream. It doesn't matter what time of year it is. Uh, this one is an almond, and yeah, I've really enjoyed this one. Smashing big fragrance. Oh, next one is um, some anti-back hand wash. I've, got, I've always got these in all my bags, work bag. Have it in my car because obviously we're coming up now to cold and flu season, so it's always handy to have some of this with you. Um, oh. 
random hair tie. Really like these because they don't they don't break your hair. They smash in. Right. The next thing is some sunglasses. Um, I've always wanted a pair of Chanel sunglasses. Now, of course, they're very expensive. But what I did, it took me about over two years to get them. I put ten pounds a week away. I put birthday money and if I got any money at Christmas I also put that away so it took me like I say over two years but I absolutely love them went and bought them and I was handing the money over in the shop and I thought what are you doing it's such a lot of money and I got home for about two days I had buyer's remorse I thought no nope, I'm gonna have to take them back I can't, I can't cope with it and then I thought what are you doing you've saved up for them you've always wanted them um, just just wear them so I'll show you them on they could do with a little bit of polish because they've got a bit of foundation on but I'll just show you them love these absolutely love them I can't tell you how much pleasure I get out of them every time I put them on and I look after them I always fold them up put them back in the case and I also carry it, have a little bag that they go in as well so I really do look after them so like I said there were a lot of money but I've absolutely loved them. Um, I've got a couple of random receipts in the bottom. Uh, an Asda, an Asda receipt. And what's the other one? Oh, this one's from the body shop. I picked up a clay mask, a Himalayan clay mask. I've only used it once, but really, really enjoyed that. It um, really draws your skin and, yeah, Smashing. The last few things I've got, oh some tea bags. I always carry these around with me. Um, I like herbal tea and this one's a three ginger and turmeric. Um, you don't taste the turmeric, it's it's really nice ginger flavour, it's like it captures you at the back of your throat and I like that. So I have got, uh, yeah, I've got quite a few, I've got three in the bottom of my bag. Um, and then I've got, oh your trolley, a trolley here. Uh, coin you've always needed one of those with you and I think that's about it oh no I found a pound I didn't know I had that <laughs> so that's good <laughs> oh dear so I hope you've enjoyed my what's in my bag um I don't know about you but they're some of my favorite uh, things to watch on YouTube I know they were really popular a few years back but I still I still enjoy them I think I think as a woman you're always curious on what other women carry around with them. So I hope to catch you again in another video. Thank you for watching. Bye.